Hey guys, I'm John Setzler. Welcome back to Man Cave Meals. Today we're going to fire up the Lone Star Grills 20 by 42 pellet smoker and we're going to do my predictable uh, go-to overnight pork butt cook. So let's get started. I'm going to kick things off by firing up the smoker and letting it preheat to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. I like to keep my pork butt prep fairly simple. All I do is I do a, I score a diamond pattern on the top and the bottom, and then I put a thin smear of mayonnaise on the outside that I like to use as a binder. The next step is to just put a nice uh, liberal coat of your favorite barbecue rub on top of the meat, pat it in, and we'll let that sit while our grill comes to temperature. Now that our grill is adequately preheated to 200 degrees Fahrenheit, we're going to open it up and we're going to set this pork butt in the middle on the top rack. And we are going to start the first phase of our cook, which is going to be a long, low and slow overnight cook in the smoke at 200 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm going to start my timer here so we can see how this cook uh, pans out in the different time stages. Here we are at the 12 hour mark. We're gonna have a look at this butt and you have to make a couple of decisions at this point. The internal temperature of the meat here is at about 145 and you have to determine if your bark's where you want it to be. I like for my bark to be a little bit darker than this before we go on to the wrap. But even though I'm not ready to wrap yet, I'm gonna go ahead and ramp the temperature of the smoker up to 300 degrees. After about another hour and ramping the temp up to 300 degrees, I'm pretty happy with what my bark looks like at this point, so now I want to wrap this guy in foil. I like to give mine a nice double wrap in foil uh, where I don't have to worry about a hole poking through in it, and once I have it wrapped, we're just going to put it back on the grill and let it finish cooking. On this cook, we're right at the 16 hour mark, and I believe our butt's ready. I have checked this, and I'm going to show you here that this guy is just absolutely super probe tender, and we're temping out at almost 204 degrees. So now we'll just rest this in the cooler for several hours. I rested this pork butt in the cooler for four hours, and as you can see here, that bone just slides out with no resistance whatsoever and this pork just wants to fall apart. It's got beautiful color, it's got a beautiful deep smoke ring and the smoke aroma that's coming from this is just crazy. This is a perfect cook and here at the end I'm going to give you a quick cheat sheet with the uh, details of what we've done here so you can cook on your own schedule. So give this method a try. This method takes what I like to tell people 15 hours, give or take an hour, depending on the size of your pork butt from nine to 10 pounds. So let me know what you think. Until next time, this is John Setzler with Man Cave Meals.